December 22nd, 2010. How a freak diversion of the jet stream is paralyzing the globe with freezing conditions. It's snowing in Australia and California, yet warm in Greenland. The freezing conditions that have blasted Britain are being blamed on a series of weather patterns that are bringing Arctic temperatures to much of Western Europe, California, and even Australia. One of the main factors is a change in the position of the jet stream, the fast-moving current of air that moves from west to east high in the atmosphere. Changes in the jet stream path can cause massive changes in weather conditions across the globe, and may be why Australians are now shivering their way through summer and the current freezing conditions in California. In a normal British winter, when conditions are mild and soggy, the jet stream lies over northern Europe and at an altitude of between 35,000 and 50,000 feet. During these gray winters, Britain's prevailing winds come from the west and southwest and bring, them, and bring with them warm and moist air from the subtropical Atlantic. <clears throat> this year, a high-pressure weather system over the Atlantic is blocking the jet stream's normal path and forcing it to, be, forcing it to the north and south of Europe. The areas of high pressure act like st stones in a stream, blocking the normal flow of milder air from the west, instead forcing colder air from the north down across the UK. In California, more than 12 inches of rain have fallen in parts of Santa Monica Mountains. In the south, and 13 feet of snow have accumulated at the Mammoth Mountain Ski Resort. and Australians expecting to bask in an early summer sun this Christmas are instead shivering as icy gusts sweeping up from the southern ocean have blanketed parts of the east coast states of New South Wales and Victoria with up to four inches of snow in summer. When the jet stream is blocked by high pressure it dips southwards and lets freezing air flood from the Arctic regions. Other weather patterns also causing havoc across the May also be affecting the weather, such as currents in the tropical Pacific Ocean called La Nina, which is disturbing the jet stream over the northern Pacific and North America. A combination of our unusual wet Atlantic weather system striking these freezing cold fronts results in a huge amount of snowfall and brings Britain to a grinding halt. A Met Office spokesman, the the problem is we are not getting the warmer Atlantic air that normally keeps our winters mild. We can see that it is unseasonably warm over Canada and Greenland, and this is where the warm air has, has been diverted. He said that any change in the pressure over the Atlantic would need to last for several days before it would be no, we would notice any change in the weather in Europe. Freezing cold winters and mild, milder winters tend to cluster in groups as the jet stream changes its path. Experts are still unsure why this is suspect, but suspect it may be related to El Nino weather system as well as changes in sea temperatures and solar activity. I will provide the link below.